Hi YouTube, today I'm doing a product review on probably my most used skincare product of all time. This is a really safe product that if you're in a transitional period where you're looking for a new skincare line or just uh, basically changing up your whole skincare routine in general and you don't know what's a good temporary moisturizer to use or brand in general, it would be the Cetaphil Moisturizing Cream. And um, sorry, there's a little bit of a glare, but I'm sure everyone has seen this at the drugstore. They literally have Cetaphil at every Target, Walmart, Walgreens, even grocery store if you buy things at the grocery store. But um, again, this is a very safe product for me. And because I first started using it when I started acne prescriptions from the dermatologist. Because I looked online and I saw that a lot of dermatologists recommend the brand Cetaphil to use alongside heavy, heavy acne prescriptions, which honestly dry out your skin pretty bad because they're meant more to get the job done with your acne, not to improve your overall, overall skincare health. But anyway, so I started using this about several years ago, and I've used it on and off for several years. Um, pretty much whenever I'm switching to a new moisturizer, I will spend a couple weeks using this again. It never harms my face. It never causes me to break out. It never causes anything bad to happen, basically. It's a good, safe product because it gives. it's a very thick cream. Um... The texture is really, really thick. It's not one of those thin moisturizers. And um, it's a it's a pretty big jar, and it lasts me a really long time. You can totally not see that because of the glare. But, um, yeah, it's a really big amount. I probably buy about one or two of these a year, and I'm totally good. Because, generally, this isn't my main product. So, if this was people's main product, then you would get them a lot faster, but I mainly use these for my neck and my eyes sometimes if I run out of eye cream, but this is a good transitional product anyway. So it's super, super thick. It's good for really dry skin, but obviously like any type of skin type can use this. It's just a good, thick, moisturizing cream. It's meant for more sensitive skin. That's why I consider it such a safe product because it's not gonna mess your skin up. It's not gonna cause bad results. But you know how some skin products, they really have a big adverse effect on you? This is not at all. This is just gonna really moisturize your skin and it's not gonna really, it's never really improved skin tone for me or a lot of other things. It just made my skin feel hydrated and for a lot of people that's all they really want. But if you're really looking for a nourishing cream with a lot of vitamins or to looking to improve your skin quality, I wouldn't really recommend this cream. All I really think it does is moisturizes. And I think it's more meant for night, honestly, because it does tend to look really greasy on my face. I'm other people on the in the internet have had no problems with a greasy face with it, but I've seen it make my face pretty greasy. But um it the sale price is probably about ten to fifteen dollars, depending on where you get it on sale. Um, so it's a little more expensive, but it's a really, really thick cream, and it's gonna last you a really, really long time. So I think it's I think it's well priced. Um, and plus, there's so many more expensive creams out there. I think if you're looking for a super, super basic, plain moisturizer, I think Cetaphil is your brand. It's dermatologist recommended. It's really trusted and safe. So yeah, this is my review for Cetaphil Moisturizing Cream. If you're in that transitional period, I think you should go out and get it. I think every girl should have this in her cabinet. I think if you're looking for a night where you just need to super, super moisturize your face and your moisturizer isn't just doing it, this is good. I don't really see a lot of skin improvement with it, but it definitely it does, it does its job. So hats off to it. And thank you, and I will see you soon.